Doctors are raising awareness about a common heart condition in younger people, especially women. It's called SCAD, which is short for Spontaneous Coronary Artery Dissection. Spontaneous coronary artery dissection can be thought of as a tearing of the arteries of the heart where the wall of the artery is compromised, so there's poor blood supply. And if you have poor blood supply to the heart, what does the heart do? That causes a heart attack. That's Dr. Jason Kovacic, a cardiologist at Mount Sinai Hospital in New York City, who spoke with NBC's Stephanie Gosk. Last year, his practice treated eight dozen cases, a fraction of the one million Americans who suffer from heart attacks each year. He says SCAD is the most common cause of heart attack in younger women, and it is often undiagnosed. We're definitely seeing a lot more cases. It's a question to us as to whether there's truly more of this happening or whether we're just a lot better at diagnosing and recognizing it. What do you suspect is, is the case? I suspect we're, we're definitely a lot better at diagnosing and recognizing it. SCAD is something Alexandra Velasic was treated for at just 33 years old. She thought she was having a heart attack. When the blood test came back, there was an elevated level of a protein that is released during a cardiac episode. and so. The ER doctor told me, I know this isn't what you want to hear. I'm so surprised to see this myself and we weren't expecting this. In other words, you've had some kind of heart attack. Yes, that's when it became real. That was the most terrifying moment. There is no cure for SCAD and no diagnostic test. So the message is clear. Do not ignore the warning signs. Doctors hope that in the next decade, there will be specific therapies just for SCAD. For more information, visit our website, wgrz.com.